it is more important to preach the good doctrine than it is to expose false doctrine. Or don't we know, Romans 1, God will indeed give people up to the lusts of their own hearts. Think about the Apostle Paul in Acts 17. His spirit was provoked by the presence of idols in the city of Athens. But in his sermon on the Areopagus, he doesn't waste not a moment on the Greek gods. Rather, he confronts the Epicureans and the Stoics, the philosophers, wise, learned men, university men for their time, and calls them ignorant. He says he declares to them the one that they have a, a pillar and an altar for, but no image, the unknown God. And he says that time of ignorance, God will now forgive. And this has all been signified by the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead. Resurrection, which was a hateful doctrine to them because they believed that all matter was bad and all spirit was good. If you're not preaching Christ and him crucified, you ain't doing nothing. If you want a fresh apple, you gotta pick it off the tree.